Hey guys, I just want to talk about bicycle cable locks a little bit today. Here are some examples of some cheapy uh, bicycle cable locks. Uh, I've seen actually a lot of these in use, so I thought I'd talk about them. You could see that they're kind of small, but they're actually pretty easy to pick too. I'll just use this knockoff Bogota style rake. And actually, let me show you that it's locked first. And then we'll just play a little tension with the rake and see what we can do. There we go. So, no skill involved, just a rake. What was that, like, I don't know, five, six seconds? And it's open, so yeah, you could cut these if you want, or you could just rake them. And I think raking is actually maybe easier and less time consuming than cutting. But, let me show you something I have. The forever lock version of the cable lock. You can see it's much more heavy duty than these cheapies. And of course, can't be picked. At least it has the, the classic unpickable mechanism here. This doesn't have the key in it yet. So, you know, if with no key, if you turn the lever, of course it won't open. So, if you want, want it to open it, then you'd grab your key, place it inside, rotate it, and then you can turn the lever and it opens. So yeah, you can see that this, is, this version is uh, more heavy duty than the uh, ones that I showed. It looks like it's about a 10 millimeter braided steel cable. It uh, has the vinyl coating to prevent scratching your bike and it has this rubber bumper to help prevent um, hitting your bike too. So your bike should be well protected. Uh, these aren't being mass produced yet, but I will be, um, I will be getting a small amount to distribute to see how people like them. I will be selling them. Uh, I, I still have to figure out the price, uh, but I will post that on my Facebook page. So if you want one of these, uh, you can go to my Facebook page and let me know and I'll put you on the request list. Uh, a lot of people like cable locks because they're more flexible, so you have more locking positions and they're a little bit lighter and easier to carry. Uh, so if you're not, if you, it's a little bit less secure than a U-lock, of course, everyone knows that, but you know, it's a trade-off. If you feel like it's, you need to put your bike in a situation that's not uh, super at risk then you could pick one of these up uh, plus it looks really cool so yeah thanks for watching